Okay, so this is the modified water, water bottle drill. Okay, and this is a great way to understand float, uh, collection of energy, and, and the dragging concept to the release concept. Okay, so let's look at this. So I've got this, you can see how much water I have in this long water bottle. Longer water bottles work better, it's about a quarter full. And the reason why we do this, you're going to hold this in your right hand only, take a general stance like you're going to, you're going to swing it back, away from your body, wide, and then right, before, right when you go to float, you'll hear that, if you can't hear this on video, that water has shifted now from the top to here. So it stayed, stayed here, it shifted as I floated to the bottom. I'm going to maintain that on the bottom, maintain it, maintain it, you can see it's trying to go forward, but if you went this way, which is what negative energy is, this way. Positive energy is when it's stayed, maintained and very neutral, very, very much, you can see it's like this. And it's not like that either. It's too much. That's overlag, okay? So you can see I floated, now maintain that. Now watch, I'm going to throw that water all out to my grip alignment point. So I'm going to swing back, float, that collects energy, the collection is the water at the bottom now. I'm going to drag that water, drag that energy, and release. And you just practice really slow. Then, you'll hear it. Drag, then watch. Slow, 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 drag, 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 slow. And that's where essentially you're starting to start to learn how to gather this power. This is not the power zone. This is a collection of power. This is a collection. This is containing the power that you that you maintain, that you gather. This is releasing the the, uh, the power, but also the accuracy, because we have a cliff base and golf. So let's take another look at this. Swing back, collect. Notice that. Notice the knees. That's not. I don't want it to be like this. I want it to be like a real swing. Really a lot here. Look at Gary Woodland. The video of Gary Woodland. He does it phenomenal. Here, it's at the bottom now. I'm going to drag that as long as I can. See, the water's equal now. That means I haven't lost it. It's neutral. It's actually positive right there. And then I let it go. So it's here. And just feel that. At the end, right before, right as I've collected this water's neutral here, then I shoot that to the grip alignment point. Not this way. But see, then I watch. If I flip it, the water goes this way. When I practice this drill, I want to contain this water and throw it where everything, all the water is down, like this. And I keep it down, even if I turn through it. So if I'm here, at no point do I want to this way. So it's here. So I can hear it. So I've got it down. It's shifted. Drag it. Accelerate it. Don't accelerate. This is accelerate before you drag. That's not, see, there's nothing. Okay? Float, drag it. So when you guys see, I've had several guys comment on how much shaft bend I have at impact and shaft lean, but the bowing of the shaft. And that's for, that happens for many reasons. But the, the main reason is that I, it's all these concepts that you see are coming to one impact. And that's why I have that. And that's why great players have that. As they load here, they drag this in. When they let hit right here, all the energy is like hitting a brick wall with your left side right here at the grip alignment point. Okay? And it's, all the power is coming out that you've maintained. But if you didn't create anything, you know, if you, if you didn't create anything, there's no power here. It's straight. There's just no power. You have to load the power. Contain it. Collect it. Drag it. Contain it. And you have to let it out. See? If you get this in your real golf swing, and you can. See, it looks like I'm whipping it here. I'm not. I'm dragging it there. Dragging it. And here. Notice I'm not... That's not it. It's not this way. It's forward. It's not this way. 
it's not violent here like that, see? It's here, and you keep dragging it. Then you let it go. There you go. Have some fun with that. Do it over and over as you start to feel the energy of the water. That's the energy of the shaft that you're, that, that you're trying to work with, and then obviously the energy of the body. You have to, 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 to release power, you have to store power. Okay? To release power, you have to store power. You have to create torque. And these are the ways, these are the components of power and accuracy both together at the same time. There's no such thing as one or the other, both at the same time. Good luck.